I'm Josh Ramey. Caleb. This is Krista. Sarah. This is Katie. And it's time for the grunt. It's Tuesday, September 11th. I'm Josh. And it's time for your morning announcements. In our top news today, West Virginia Lions Youth Exchange Contest is underway. The Youth Exchange Contest is a scholarship that provides funds for students in grades 10 through 12 toward a four to six week cultural exchange to Finland, Japan, Italy, Peru, or Australia during the summer of 2013. Three travel grants of $1,500 will be awarded. The contest deadline is November 15th. If interested, entry forms are available in the counselor's office. The PSAT will be given at LCHS on Wednesday, October 17th. The PSAT is open for sophomores and juniors. In order, in order to participate in the National Merit Scholarship Program, a student must qualify their junior year in high school by attaining the necessary scores on the PSAT. Cost is $14 per student, and fee waivers are available for eligible 11th graders. Students interested in taking the PSAT must register with Miss Mary Mullins and the counselor's office by Friday, September 21st. There is a limited number of tests. Registration will be on the first-come, first basis. In continuing news, Health Occupations will be sponsoring a blood drive on Tuesday, October 2nd. There will be a gear-up field trip October 25th for juniors to attend a student leadership academy at Marshall University. Seating is very limited, and if you want to attend, you can go to www.wvgearup.org and clicking on the link that says Sign Up for School and Regional Events. FCA Marshall Game Day will be October 27th at the Marshall U.S. UCF football game. The price for the event, which includes game ticket, pre-game rally, tailgating, transportation, and t-shirts is $30. Permission slips are available in Mr. Ice's room 2109 and are due by September 28th. The FCA will be sponsoring See You at the Pole on Wednesday, September 26th. This event will begin at 9 o'clock and all students and staff are invited to attend. The fall production for LCHS Theater will be the Little Theater's production of Hamlet by Jean Batlow. Auditions will be posted this week and held later next week. Rehearsals will be held after school Wednesday and Thursday. The play will be November 5th through 11th. In sports news, the girls volleyball team plays tonight at home against Mann High School. There will be a golf match today at Little Creek versus Nitro, and the boys and girls soccer team will play away at Cabell Midland. Student government elections are scheduled for this Thursday during AA. We are introducing the candidates for each grade level, and today we meet the 10th grade candidates. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are here with our 10th grade candidates for president. And you are? I'm Brady McComas. I'm Raven McCormick. I'm Sam Kirkendall. I'm Natalie Saul. Cody Hobson. Isaiah Smith. The Gustafer. And our vice presidential nominees are Miss Isabella Baisden, Michael McDermott, Kevin St. Gregory, Dakota Smith, and I want you to vote for me. You hear that, folks? This guy is serious. Our nominees for Secretary Caden Hudson and Destiny Knapper. And our two nominees for Treasurer are Matthew Atkins and Philip Hager. All right, ladies and gentlemen, those are your candidates for the 10th grade. Vote wisely. All right, Panthers, don't forget to check us out on our YouTube page or tweet at us at LCHS Pride. Remember, don't use your cell phone during the school day. I'm not going to mess up. I know how to talk. Am I standing? Do I need to do something with my arm? I need to do something with my arm. What do I need to do? <laughs> <laughs> I'm Sam Kirkendall, and I believe that together we can make a better school and eventually a better community. I support cookies, puppies, and mudding. <laughs>